The market is crashing and we might just be headed into a recession. So what should you do? Should you sit on the sidelines or should you buy the dip that keeps on dipping? Listen folks, millionaires are made in a recession. Some of the wealthiest folks you know made their fortune when there was blood in the streets, such as the housing market crash back in 09. Even some influencers such as Meet Kevin, Minority Mindset, and even Graham Stephan have all claimed to have made a ton of money by buying up property when there was a recession or blood in the streets. Now, I'm not your financial advisor, but if you have been sitting on the sidelines, this is the time to get in. This is a time to be buying into the market. If you already dollar cost average, consider doubling down. Let's say you invest $100 a week. Maybe consider investing $200 a week. If you've been buying the dip all year, just like I have, I feel your pain. It's like you buy the dip and the dip keeps on dipping and dipping and dipping. So much so that I've been out of cash for over three months. In fact, I actually borrowed money to invest and now the market is down even more. And if you're in a situation like this, all I can say is try to stay away from leverage, try to stay away from margin. You should not be borrowing money to invest in a time like this. And if you're out of money, find ways to make more money. Focus on your existing job, maybe build an emergency fund, and then consider finding a second job or maybe a side hustle or whatever to bring in more income. As far as investing, ideas I do have a couple videos on how to ride through a recession and how to invest in a recession so be sure to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy content like this but here are some ideas if you think we're headed into recession consider some safer investments such as I bonds where you can get as much as a 9.62 percent return on your money virtually risk-free I talk about that in this video right here where you can learn the basics everything you need to know about I bonds along with a step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can buy bonds you can also think about buying stocks that seem to do better than others in a recession I've personally found energy ETFs and dollar stores and consumer staples to do pretty well riding through a recession but of course do your own research another option might be dividend stocks but not just any dividend stocks in fact dividend aristocrats or dividend and kings would seem to have a track record of success a track record of paying dividends consistently and even increasing dividends regardless of our economic state in fact dividend stocks can actually be even more attractive in an economic downfall because as the price of the stock drops the dollar value of the payout that these stocks pay out continues to be consistent if not increases and that results in you receiving a higher yield or a higher return on your investment in the form of a dividend allowing you you to lock in higher returns over the long term and finally you could always just sit on cash if you feel this isn't the right time for you to keep buying stocks as I mentioned earlier there are safer alternatives and I don't just mean high yield savings accounts but instead inflation correlated bonds which can really help keep you afloat in this modern era of uncertainty now if you are on the fence about stocks just know this the more stocks continue to go down they can only go down so much more and the lower they go the more more upside they might actually have so I'll leave you with that thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my perspective thank you